Go on. First one down. All right, I'll read this one because it's. Oh. Short. Shh, 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 shh. Wait, which one? Is somebody I can't commanding go. me one? No, no, I was literally just silencing the entire chat universe. As you were. Prior to speaker to Andy. And on knob. Okay. This one is called Anastasia's Inner Goddess comes out. Oh shit. Hilo, wake okay. up. Okay. <laughs> All right. <clears throat> Let me uh get ready. Okay. What do you whoa whoa whoa? whoa. What do you mean get ready? Into my mouth, so I can feel it. Okay. <laughs> All right. Oh. <laughs> we didn't really do it. Go go go. Go. Okay. Um, I pull him deeper into my mouth, so I can feel him at the back of my throat, and then to the front again. My tongue swirls around the end. He's my very own Christian Grey flavored popsicle. I suck harder and harder. Mmm. My inner goddess is doing the merengue with some salsa moves. <laughs> that is so minute? going on YouTube, <laughs> by the way. I'm AFK, I need to be alone. <laughs> it's your boy. <laughs> It's your boy. Yeah. It's your boy, Dave. He's just sitting. He's just sitting, and it's your boy, Little Dave, is here. Oh, one sec. What time is it? Us. I need a timestamp that shit. <laughs> that is fucking cash money right there. Oh. Okay, read another one. Okay, now hang about you just raised the bar for yourself now, Wendy. Hit that shit. <laughs> In fact, I'm gonna do no DPS and move away from the mob so that the fucking sound effects don't distort it. I read a quick bit from V while she picks one. Being a loose cannon does not play by the rules. The first thing I did was ignore the warning Pick and smear this one. all over my knob and bollocks. <laughs> my bollocks, I knew I left. <laughs> The bollocks I, I know and loved are now gone. In their place is a maroon coloured of agony, which sends pain up my body every time it grates against a fire or article of clothing. And they're suffering so hard that you don't have to heed my lesson. Do not put a knob and bollocks. <laughs> oh my god, I'm not going to fucking cry. I said, I don't think I'm gold. Move a lot. Oh dear. <laughs> <laughs> one second, we've seen that one that Ali said. Uh, I've got it actually open. Is it the Harry Bowl thing? It is indeed. Any of them? Any of them. Okay. Oh man. Words cannot express what happened after, to me after eating these. The gummy bear cleanse. If you're someone that can tolerate sugar substitute, enjoy. If you're dozens of other people that have tried my order, run. First of all, for the taste, I read these five. Oh good. Soft. Who to taste fruit flavours, which is the, like the sugary variety. I was a happy camper. But. <laughs> or should I say, but. Not too long after eating about 20 of these, all hell broke loose. <laughs> <laughs> I had the gastro experience like I've never imagined. Cramps, sweating, bloated beyond my worst nightmare. I had food poisoning from some bad shellfish that was almost skipped in the park compared to what was going on inside me. It's fucking gummy bears! Oh, flatulence. <laughs> Heavens, the McGroid. The sounds like trumpets calling demons back from hell. <laughs> 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 vomiting. I not stand in one room for fear of succumbing to my own odour. But wait, there's more. What came out of it felt like someone had tried to funnel Niagara Falls through a coffee store. I swear these sphincters were screaming. It felt like a delicate starfish was now a gaping more projectile vomiting a torrid flood of toxic waste. 100% liquid, flammable liquid, napalm! It was actually a bit humorous for a nanosecond, as it was just beyond anything I could ever possibly imagine. And it went on for hours. <laughs> the best part of that is funneling microphones. <laughs> I felt violated when it was over. I think might have been something in the early morning of the next day. 
there was stuff coming out of me that I ate in my wedding in 2000. <laughs> Love's the best one about this one. Uh, I've seen uh, someone try to eat the entire five pound bag in one sitting. Uh, 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 like the clean shaven I like the look. Down <sighs> shaven look down my gentleman's log. So for the past few years I've used a shaven. <laughs> 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 like having that's the worst bit. <laughs> However, the hair seems to keep growing back, which means every six months I have to spend 20 minutes trimming again. As I'm sure you realise, it's a valuable time I cannot waste. <laughs> <laughs> so I decided to get to the root of the problem, and I purchased this product. Probably the first thing you will notice after using the product is the pain. Although as a man I lack the required experience, I'm going to estimate this is at least 11 times more powerful than childbirth. <laughs> Imagine sticking a rusty razor blade into your favourite eye before turning your hands behind your back. <laughs> then imagine that you use the entrenched razor blade to slice open a raw onion. <laughs> this, this product is slightly more painful than that. However, if we ignore all this blinding, crippling, debilitating pain, I should point out this product is remarkably efficient. Before all matter of of organisms great and small li live down there. Now nothing can grow, not even on a cellular level. <laughs> Yo, what is, how do the girls feel word. about this? Like, oh. Sadly, this includes my genitalia. I spent the last four hours staring <laughs> fixedly at Carol Gordon's ass, all to no avail. <laughs> my, my tinky wrinkle turn has not even so much as perked up. <laughs> If I remove seeds a bit harsh, it's only because I wanted children. <laughs> in summary, pro, small expense certainly doesn't burn a hole in my pocket. Cons did burn a hole in my scrotum. <laughs> in all effect, reasonably priced product, free star. Where's this uh, second paragraph of um, Fifty Shades of Grey anyway? <laughs> Oh fuck! Excellent product. Most <laughs> most business <laughs> offensive in five. Yo, look at the stream right now. <laughs> <laughs> <You're not. laughs> oh, oh, fuck you! <laughs> Welcome to the raiding and the watchman. Get your ass to silver. It's a comic. I haven't recently rolled a, won a role in adult movie industry I just want to use that I Sorry. needed to engage in some intimate deliberation. I might as... I may say this stuff is perfect for the task. As well as removing all the hair from my nevers, it also made them turn bright red and almost swell to half their usual proportions. <laughs> play in resulted in me in screaming in agony like an angry baboon for two solid days. All in all, the director said I was natural and doubled my fee. Two thumbs up. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my face hurts. I recommend uh, diluting before use. Personally, I diluted it with deep heat and oven cleaner. <laughs> <laughs> so it's pain in my balls is far more bearable. Do not get this stuff up on your bell end. <laughs> I think Ghost has stopped because I'm on the street. <laughs> Probably attacked He's broken. <laughs> Can he breathe, guys? I don't think so. I'm trying to find yeah, I'm fine, I'm fine. There's an incredible one somewhere. I'm trying to find it. He looks like he's in so much need. <laughs> Fuck. I'm good, I'm good.
We're good. We're good. <sighs> He's asking in stream where you get these like these reviews. Beat um Amazon reviews. <coughs> Beat for men. Beat men. Being a student comes with the obvious benefits of lots of alcohol and sleep, and more spare time than is good for a human being. However, the downside is irritated and frustrating company of a housemate who is so far up their own ass it makes you want to cry. <laughs> Having tried to get rid of Kevin, as he shall be known, for a number of months, using practical jokes as changing his shaving cream for squirty cream, putting cling film over the toilet, <laughs> hiding rotten eggs in his pillowcase, amongst others, <laughs> tried to try and drive him out of this house. We came up with a cunning plan. Kevin happened to mention one day that he had an embarrassing problem and we asked if we could, in total confidence course, suggest a solution. Well, to cut a long story short, the sort of problem when sitting down on a cold surface for too long. We've been being helpful housemates we were, we suggested the application of a certain cream that would undoubtedly ease the suffering. <laughs> All very nice, amicable, helpful so far, I hear you thinking. Sure, that already you're sitting uncomfortably on your seats, thinking where this may be going. Kevin, irritating and frustrating as he was, and no doubt still is, although he may have mellowed up so much by now, was a very shy young man, and he, the thought of buying such an ointment filled him with dread. How kind and thoughtful we were, therefore, that we asked for to go on a, in on Saturday afternoon into town and pick it up for him. Well, what an opportunity. <laughs> we dully, duly walked the half mile zone to town and purchased a tub of said ointment for Kevin, along with a tube of the most excellent Veep for Men cream. When we returned to the brown paper bag containing the ointment, Kevin suggested that he read the instructions before use. Apply liberately to affected area, etc, etc, etc. The fact the tube inside the box didn't match the box itself was easily explained by the fact the chemist had re recommended this particular brand for men, and therefore be more effective instead. Kevin duly went off to apply the li liberally apply the lotion to affected area. After a few minutes later, he came hey, screaming up. and shouting out of the bathroom. Trousers and Bart Simpson pants around his ankles. <laughs> he stood still long enough to look at us a fraction of a second to know what happened. The next morning, when the burning had pain had subsided, he gingerly sat down on the table having breakfast, 3 p.m., and declared he had had enough and was moving out. All in all, best ten ninety nine ever <laughs> spent. Five stars for removal of properties, although I cannot vouch if it actually works for hair removal. Fuck you know. I'm so <laughs> the best stuff coming out of me that I ate in a wedding at two thousand and three. <laughs> yeah, we need we need to do it one more time. Yeah, I'm coming. <gasps> doing what we're doing. Same again. Anyway. Yeah, Wendy, come on. Change the tone, Wendy, and give us another paragraph. I've got more, that's the worst thing, and this one's fucking hilarious. I think that that went a little better over stream than the Fifty Shades. Do we want? What does the stream say? Do we want another one, or do we want to go? Or do we want to go Fifty Shades? I'll tell you what. Wait, go Fifty Shades and then go for the more reviews because we need a peak in traffic. Because I don't think my, the back of my head can handle any more smiles. You did, you did like the first one down. Uh, give me a second. Wendy. Oh, Wendy. On yeah. that page. Yeah, on that page at um, Ghost Link. The hot elevator makeout session? Um, I can't remember, hold on. I think we should get one with two people talking and uh, get one god to play one and one god. <laughs> I can do that. I don't mind reading this whole shit. Um, just, just... Anastasia climaxes again and again and again. Wait, what? <laughs> that was ghosty climax. <laughs> oh, that's. <laughs> <laughs> That's the most unrealistic one out of everything. Do it. Go, do yeah. it now, right now. <laughs> do it right now. The guys don't believe it, so... Okay. Um, okay. He leans down and kisses me, his fingers still moving rhythmically inside me, his thumbs circling and pressing. His other hand scoops my hair off my head and holds my head in place. His tongue mirrors the actions of his fingers, claiming me. My legs begin to stiffen as I push against his hand. He gentles his hand, so I'm brought back from the brink. I come instantly again and again, falling apart beneath him. Then I'm building again. I climax anew, calling out his name. You are welcome. <laughs> <laughs> now, I know you've got horrible boners. Let's start again. 
<laughs> Sorry to uh, quickly relieve you of said bonus. Savage, if you would. <laughs> One day, I thought I'd give my giblets a wee trim. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, we need to wait for Savage, guys. Guys, stop, we need to wait for Savage. Okay. <sighs> but I was pissed off, constantly trying to bend my body in half to see the old, the old gooch. <laughs> <laughs> If I would have known what to do now before punching this wonderful tube of ball melting goodness, I would have just got a rib or two to take. Ri take I got a rib or two taken out. The ball be danglies. There's a couple of things I would sooner you do rather than use this tube again. Slide down a hill of razor blades with my balls for, for breaks. Take a running jump into a traffic cone. Hit her first. Stick a pin under my big toenail and kick kick the wall. Fart a hose pipe to the uh, fart into a hose pipe at the opposite end of my mouth. <laughs> Problem is, I didn't read the instructions. But you proceeded to use half the tube, lather my my veiny thumb up so I didn't look like Casper the Ghost. <laughs> Not only did I do this, I once done, I left a wee trail leading up to the old rusty bucket. <laughs> Bam! Twenty seconds later, I felt like Celta himself was ramming me with his fiery pitchfork right in the top of his mouth. <laughs> and lucky for me, lucky for me, I managed to get a right dollop right on the mushroom tip. <laughs> but there I am, standing in the bathroom, feeling like Andre the Giant, with me swinging around the... My dong, while, while someone is waiting like a pineapple shoved sideways into my bangle. <laughs> Never again. I'm speaking like a 12 year old choir boy, walking like John Wayne. Oh, I found a really good uh, review for you to see. Yeah, chuck me it, chuck the link. <laughs> oh dear. Oh <laughs> my god. It's by E Twat. Eat what? Eat what? <laughs> we moved. We're fucking left in behind you twats. Eat what? Here we go. Ready? I found the best way to to apply this is to fill an empty yogurt pot. One with a white Wait. top, such as Muller, not the crunch corner. Get that confused. <laughs> you may wish to use a similar <laughs> cup of ice cold water to hand. Simply squat over the cream and lower your back ball sack in. Wiggle around a bit to make sure a nice even coat and remove. <laughs> Wait the allotted time. You may need a willing partner to mop, to mop your brow or wipe the tears from your eyes. <laughs> Scrape off the hair and then lower your ball sack into cold water. If you wish to create a hilarious comedy moustache, have a double-sided sellotape handy and simply scrape the hairs off this and apply to your top lip. Make sure an adult is present and uses any sharp items for you. And watch your friends with your comedy moustache once you have dressed. 